channel. Thanks for watching. So y'all are wanting to know how I curl my hair. So I'm gonna show you exactly what I use, the products I use, the curling wand, everything. And I'm gonna share some of my tips and also some really fun, trendy hairstyles that I've been trying and loving lately. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. All the links are down in the description and be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. I think it's important to note that this is day three hair. I feel like the messier, not messier, but the dirtier your hair is, the better your curls will hold. But we don't want oily roots at all, so I will show you the product that I use to keep my roots nice and matte and clean um, while giving the rest of my hair some texture. So the curling wand that I've been using is one from Numi. It is the Numi and Noah Corel 3-in-1 triple threat wand, and this is great because it comes with three interchangeable wands, so you have different styles that you can do. It's super nice, um, and I'll show you everything that that it comes with it's such a good value this is the star of the show but I'll show you her in a moment um, I love these clips and it comes with two of them they're great for holding your hair back for when you're doing your like hair sectioning it or even when you're doing your makeup and it also comes with this silicone mat that you can place down and place your hot tools on it to protect your surfaces so here she is and she comes in this beautiful pink like rose toned travel case which is so nice for traveling on the go and even like storage when you're not using it she unrolls and it has this little um ah, hanger right here so you can hang it up on a hook in your bathroom so this one is the base this is where you put all of the interchangeable wands and it has a really nice led screen there this is the first wand and it's a tapered one. This is great for ringlet type curls. This is the second wand and it's equivalent to a inch barrel, which um, is great for that traditional like Hollywood type bouncy curls. And the third barrel is equivalent to an inch and a half barrel and this is great for really beachy, nice waves. It also comes with this really nice styling comb, which is really cool and different. I've never seen one like that. And it also comes with this protective glove to keep your hands nice and safe from the heat since they are wands. I love interchangeable kits like this because instead of having three or four different irons, you have one base with three different options that you can have so much fun with, playing with different style curls, or having a type of curl for any occasion. And I love that this set comes with everything that you need and it rolls up into this really nice travel case. I wanna thank Numi for partnering with me on today's video. I love Numi, I love their hot tools, I love their products, I love their value, I love their mission, everything that they stand for. They're a great company and I'm so excited and grateful to be partnering with them and they were nice enough to give you guys a discount code I will put it right here on the screen you can use this code for the triple threat interchangeable curling wand set that I have that I'm showing or you can use it for anything on their website the first thing I do is dry shampoo dry shampoo is my best friend and I love this one from Numi because it is a powder dry shampoo aerosols are so bad for you y'all and the environment and all that and I love this one because it works really well I've been using it the past few weeks I put it right here in my roots. It has a really precise nozzle, so it's nice for getting right where you need it to. I pretty much just section off my hair, and then I place this right in the root line, and I do this all the way across my crown. And then I'll go ahead and massage it in. It gives so much volume, and it smells so good and I massage it really well in, and it does not leave any kind of white residue. I love this stuff. I will also link this down below. Since I have pretty thick hair, I like to section my hair from the crown to the bottom of my hair, and I will just tie it up like this, and I will clip it with one of these clips, just like that. Then I will take my brush, which I love this one from Numi. It's part of the Noah Corral collection as well. It's so nice, it easily detangles. It goes through my hair like butter. Then I'm gonna take my heat protectant and spray it on my hair to protect it from the heat. Although this set is ceramic and it's super good at protecting your hair um, and not causing any damage, I still just put a little bit of heat protectant in there and then I will brush that through. So I'm gonna go with the inch and a half barrel and to add these in is really easy. You take the attachment, you line it up, make sure it's unlocked. Once it's in there securely, then you move this over to lock. <laughs> Just like that. And then you can plug it in and start it and heat it up. Now that it's plugged in, you press and hold down the power button. 
and then you can adjust your temperature as you need to. Once I'm ready to start curling, I start with about an inch, inch and a half section, and I will start curling away from my face. I leave about an inch out because I like that kind of relaxed, natural look. I will hold it for, I don't know, maybe five to, second, five to seven seconds, and then I will release the curl into my hand, just like that, and voila, look how pretty they turn out. And it's gonna look a little crazy right now, but you just wait until the end, trust the process. <laughs> so I continue doing this around the bottom half of my hair, leaving about an inch out, holding it for five to seven seconds, and then letting the curl fall into my hand. Okay, now that the bottom is all curled, now we're gonna do the top section. And here I just like to make my part and then I will section it down just like that. Again, take my easy brush from Numi. I still cannot believe how easy this day tangles my hair. My hair is so tangly. Then I'll spray with heat protectant. Again, brush that out to evenly distribute it. Protect your hairs. So for the top section, I always start in layers and I start by my ear. And the top section, I pay a little bit more attention to, maybe like hold it for a few more seconds. But again, away from my face, hold five to seven seconds, maybe eight, maybe nine to hold this girl a little bit more on the top. And then I let it fall into my hand. Just like that, so pretty. And then I just continue to grab sections and curl them. My hair has always been the type of hair that's a little bit harder to curl. And I've been so impressed with Numi and the quality of their products. The um, ceramic plates heat up so fast and they make your hair so shiny. They protect it from heat damage with the technology and it curls so quickly, even on my hair that's harder to cool, and they stay. I love it. Okay, once it is all curled, I kinda just go back through and see if there's any pieces that need to be re-curled, um, which I'm seeing this sad little strand of hair, so I'm gonna recurl that really quickly. Now what I'm gonna do is brush through these curls. Get them nice and relaxed and beachy. Then I like to kind of poof up my hair, just like that. Kind of get some volume. Then I'm gonna take hairspray and spritz it down so they stay in place. And here is where I flip my hair upside down and spray it so it stays. And I like this hairspray because it doesn't leave your hair crunchy. It is volumizing. It is climate hairspray. <laughs> and voila, we have voluminous beachy curls that are going to stay two, three days. Um, at night, I just brush them out and I put them up high in the scrunchie so there's no creases um, and they stay like all night and in the morning it just needs a little touch up and then you're good to go, ba ba boom. Super cute, love this set. Now if y'all need some hairstyle ideas, I'm gonna share with you guys with some of my favorites that have been my go-tos lately. The first one is super easy and all you need are a few little bobby pins. So basically all I do is I take a little bit of front section here, maybe about an inch or so, and I take it about an inch and a half, two inches back, and then I poof it up just a little bit. And I will secure this with bobby pins. And I will secure it in an X shape, that way the little poof <laughs> doesn't fall down and I don't lose that volume. And then I take that hair right uh, behind it and I kind of just bring it up and let it fall down in almost a way to cover those bobby pins. So you see how much just extra volume that gives and 
It just gives it a little oomph, a little something, you know? This has been my go-to for a while. So I do the same on this side. I have a side part, so I do a little bit of a smaller section on this side. And again, take the bobby pans and put them in an X. And I try to push it underneath the hair so they don't show, but the section in the back that you pull up and kind of over to waterfall, it helps cover those bobby pins. So. Here's the first one. This is my go-to that you guys probably see all the time because it's so simple and easy and quick and it gives a lot of volume and it's just la la boom. Love it. Go-to. <laughs> Let me show you the next one if you want to jazz it up a little bit. Now if you want to jazz it up a little bit more, I'm a huge fan of headbands, especially these ones are so darn cute. They have velvet and pearls and a little knot there. And I feel even with this hairstyle, it is super cute just to throw on a cute headband probably good it's so cute and effortless and really trendy right now another hairstyle I have really been enjoying is leaving a few pieces down in the front to kind of face frame my face and then taking my hair into a pony taking a really pretty scrunchie and tying it in the back like this kind of a little volume and then having the pony sit like that with a few pieces down I think is so cute and so chic and I think that the scrunchie gives it a little pop of color just a simple elegant really cute go-to hairstyle another go-to is the half up half down still with little pieces in front to face frame your face I do a half up and here I like to twist and then I bring it up. I take one of these beautiful gold clips. This came in like a pack of five or six and I love them. And I place this right here where I twisted to secure that. And then I will let the rest of the hair hang over and kind of waterfall just like that. And I think this is so cute and trendy and something really easy to do. And I think it's really, really cute so hope you guys have found this helpful and be sure to check out Numi. i will have their link as well as the discount code down in the description below thanks for watching you guys i will see you very soon in a brand new video bye